Hey everybody, Horseman here, and today I'm going to discuss a little bit about the faction here in Fallout 4 called the Brotherhood of Steel. Uh, of course, many of you Fallout fans already know who the Brotherhood of Steel is, but uh, there's a very small prefect here in uh, Boston, and when I say small, I mean like three people, and uh, they do give you the option to join them. So. There was promises of power armor and, and the like, and lots of caps, and saying that you're not allowed to do mercenary work, but luckily that's not necessarily the case. You can still go out, do side quests, and do whatever the hell you want, uh, but the people here in Boston are Paladin Dance, Knight Rice, and a scribe here, Halen. Rice here, he's kind of a jerk, but uh, whatever. So the idea here is that you can pick up missions to support the Brotherhood of the Steel, uh, find artifacts or uh, clean up mutants, monsters, raiders, whatever, to protect the people. If you're wondering where they are, you can find them right here at the Cambridge Police Station. So in reference with the rest of the map, it's about halfway down or so, and uh, you'll be when you walk in for the first time, uh, these folks will be fighting a whole bunch of uh, raider. Oh, I'm sorry, ferals. And uh, once you take care of them, help them out, they'll uh, ask you to join. So I just completed a mission, and so I'm going to turn it in and get another one, and I'll show you uh, what it's all about. Right, Halen. Did you find that technology yet? Here it is. Good work. Here's your payment. Nothing like a set of fortune. I'm always looking for tech. Let me know if you think you can handle another run. Sorry about that. Affirmative. Good. Areas on your map. Good luck. All right. Got an achievement out of it. All right. There's a couple other things. I'll show you what I look like. And uh, I'll show you what armor that I'm using at the, right now, as well as what weapons I'm using. Got a bayoneted missile launcher, boosted laser rifle. But what I'm really proud of is this sniper rifle that I managed to find. And if you want to know where it is, I'll show you real quick. I found this at a location called the General Atomics Galleria. It was behind the bowling alley, or like when you go in the bowling alley, if you go behind the pins, uh, there's a box in there, and uh, that's where I found it. So hopefully it's there for you guys as well. Oops. Some of the other things I upgraded is this shotgun. The shotgun was really nice. I got a base damage of 99. It was a legendary, so I got this off of a legendary monster, and then I upgraded it to hardened uh, in order for it to put out more damage. And I also got a combat rifle, which is also very helpful, but uh, that gummit. Uh, but the problem is, I don't have as much ammunition for it as I would like. So. Base damage of 48, I can pretty much tear a Death Claw apart pretty easily. Um, as long as they don't get their hands on me. As proven in the uh, a side quest uh, at the witch, the Witch's Museum or something or, some or other. <laughs> Excuse me. There was a quest over here, the Museum of Witchcraft, and it had some pretty nasty things in there. And luckily that weapon helped me to uh, tear it apart pretty well. As far as the gear that I have, I have mostly legendary. Uh, so I've got the uh, duelist, a 10% 10 per, uh, 10 chance to disarm, 2% luck, and this one, this is, if you're wondering why I'm walking so fast, this is why. It's been super helpful, especially getting away from death claws. So, all right, well, that's over. Honestly, I've always been fascinated with the Brotherhood of Steel. I like their ideas. I like their what they do. I just kind of wish that they uh, that f there would be a Fallout game 
that would focus on being an initiate of the uh, Brotherhood of Steel. You know, starting off as a Brotherhood, uprooting corruption uh, in, a, in a specific chapter. I think that'd be a lot of fun. So let's go to quests. Oh, flux capacitor. <laughs> Alright, let's just go ahead and do this. So you notice I'm not walking around with my power armor. Uh, I do have 27 cores, but the fact is, it is a finite resource. I don't want to use it up unless I absolutely need it. I usually bring it when I go into certain areas, but in this case, uh, I'm not going to. I walk really fast, and I have Strong with me, and he hits like a truck, and he also does a lot of other uh, good amount of damage, so I'm not necessarily worried about it. I guess I've already been in there. Landscapes are beautiful, and if, in case you're wondering, I am running a GTX 980 Ti. Uh, I haven't had too many hiccups in terms of frame rates are concerned, unless there's something else going on with my computer. You might see some little blips here and there, like maybe that, but uh, more or less, it's been pretty fantastic. I do get sidetracked easily, so bear with me. Would not be left by other human. Strong is kind of a pain in the ass, to be honest. He doesn't. He doesn't like a lot of the things that you do, and that's kind of annoying, especially for me. I'm a more of a sniper type build. Oh, flying eyeballs, that's... sniper build and then I don't actually snipe anything. That's usually how it goes. Ooh, he's hurting me. Strong. Where are you?
because of the fact that I went with more of a sniper build, I don't, I'm not able to carry as much as I would like, so it's part of the reason why I kind of, sort of, sometimes enjoy um, bringing my power armor with me, but at the same time, it doesn't really benefit my build as much, so I think in this case, I'm not going to need a rocket launcher with me, so uh, luckily, Strong can carry quite a bit of stuff, so I'm not too terribly worried about it. If you're wondering what my build's all about, I can show you. That's what I got going on right now. With the power armor, it increases it by 10 points, so that's why you can carry so much more. Um, I do have uh, bobbleheads for agility, and I think my luck is going up because of the uh, armor piece that I have. So I'd like to be able to find some more uh, bobbleheads there. Uh, I think I found a total of six so far. Matter of fact, let's take a look at data stats. Yeah, so I got six bobbleheads. All right, get to go in a bunker. Stop my shotgun. I do scavenge uh, quite a bit, so it'll probably be a little bit slow because I do like to pick up almost everything. <laughs> That's another thing. Like, if you're in your power armor, I wouldn't have been able to go to this terminal without getting out of it, and it's just kind of a pain in the foot. Just heard a rather big explosion. Don't know what that's all about. I have seen people you try to use a mini nuke indoors. It's not uh, always fun.
be able to hack there.
capstar start are a little bit hard to find around here, but now that the that whole area has been cleared, which has been which is great, got some good stuff. Uh, I know I went back and forth a lot, uh, but I do try to be you know a little thorough. Um, I don't mind so much since I can walk so fast because of that piece of armor that I got though. But uh, uh, yeah, if you want to start taking the perk to get more caps from containers and, and every time that you loot, it might be a good idea. Uh, because uh, things are quite expensive and honestly how many caps I have right now are probably the most I've ever had on hand at any one time anyway. So now that I've completed the mission, I'm going to go back, turn it in, and uh, get some uh, good vibes from the Brotherhood of Steel. And hopefully eventually they'll accept me within the ranks, give me a cool power armor so that way I can take it apart. Now granted that won't be Any yet, but... Yes, come here. Here it is. Good work. Here's a little something for the trouble. There's still plenty of undiscovered tech out there. Let me know if you think you can handle another run. Yeah, I'll take another one. Affirmative. Perfect. And rinse Got and repeat. Now, this is probably so the most wow-esque -esque, uh, type of missions where you just keep... You get something, you go back, you get something, you go back. And same thing goes for this guy. She has me find tech this guy has me clear out certain areas and uh, it's good and bad because it does get me out there exploring to certain areas uh, but at the same time I kind of wish that I would hurry up and just be accepted because it just feels like I'm doing their work so all right um, that's it for now and I uh, hope you enjoyed the video horseman out